Mother, mother, look what I found! What is it, Ash? You see, I told you there was something pretty in the water. Wow, darling, that's very lovely. What's going on over here? Look what I found in the river. Where did you say you found this? In the Arab River, sir. Dear little foal, give me that crystal. What? No! I found it. Ash, you don't understand. This thing could be dangerous. Dangerous? Are you serious? How could this be dangerous? It could hold evil magic or plague. You're not serious, are you? Magic? There are a lot of things you don't know about, Ash. <coughs> well, I'm not giving you my crystal just because you're worried about some stupid thing about magic. Jasper, alert the others that there will be a meeting tonight. Also uh, alert Xavier and other foals. Of course, sir. Make sure Ash and that crystal don't leave this area. Uh, uh yes, sir. mares and stallions. We come here tonight for several things. But first, we must tell the foals about the world they do not know about. They already know the story of Alato and Dimani, but they do not know the story that comes after that. There's another story? Yes, young one. It is the story of magic. Oh no, not this again. You think it's funny, Ash? You think that magic, that life and death, is all just a joke? Uh, no. Well then, I guess I'll just tell you the story now, won't I? During Alato's creation of the horses, he accidentally put too much of his power of life into some of them. These horses didn't know they had that power for a while. But when they did realize they had it, they used that power in many ways. They could make the wind appear out of nowhere, make themselves fly or swim, create water to drink from, fire for heat, flames as a weapon. 
They could move the earth so that it was flat. They could create earthquakes and much more. But some horses wanted to share their power and gave part of it to other horses so they could use magic as well. The selfish horses would keep all of the power for their own and sometimes even would steal it from other horses. And when the selfish ones knew they were dying, they put all their magic into an object, sometimes a common st object like a stone. But most of the times, they put it into something special, an object not commonly seen by horse eyes. The magic is very distributed in the world now, so much that the horses that do have magic have very little, including myself. I got the little magic I have from my good friend Ren. So what you're saying is Ash's crystal could hold magic? Exactly. So it's not like I know how to use it or anything. That's exactly my point. You do not know how to control magic. Magic can be very dangerous and uncontrollable if not trained properly in how to use it. You may try to make a small hole to be filled with water, but in doing so, you accidentally fill a whole valley with water. Why am I wishing for water, though? Am I thirsty? Ugh, that's not the point. The point is that you do not know how to control magic, and therefore you can be endangering yourself and everyone around you. Well, I really don't think there's any magic in this thing anyway. I mean, what are the odds of- They are very high, Ash. The odds of this happening are very high, for that is an uncommonly found item. And if it does have magic in it, it is the magic of a spoiled soul. I don't want that influencing you. Okay, I'll be careful then. No magic wishes coming out of me. Give me the crystal ash. What? No! Give. Me. The. Crystal. Now. No. And you know what? I think you just want that crystal for yourself so you can be as powerful as Rin. No, Ash. I want it so I can destroy it immediately. No. Ash, this is the last time I'm telling you. Give me the crystal now. Never. Stop, please. I do not mean to disobey you, sir. But Ash is our friend, and we won't let you hurt him. I am not going to hurt him. I'm only going to take the crystal away from him. Maybe Ash is right. Maybe you do want it for yourself. Maybe not now, but someday. And he did find it on his own. Yeah, I mean, Comanche and I didn't even offer to help him look for it. I mean, maybe the Great Lord wants Ash to have the crystal. Oh, you young fools. Maybe you're right. Elito does work in mysterious ways. But if anything, even a shift in the wind occurs when Ash has that crystal, I'm taking it away. Deal? Deal. Very well then.